Hello, everyone. This is Panorama. Panorama. This is Panorama. Yeah, but this is the prelog, so this is not the full game. And we'll look at it and see if we desire the full game or not. I don't know. Look how small, like, look how much they improve like, on this. It's like really nice. I've seen someone play the full game. I have to see if I can get a full game. Sometime. <laughs> <clears throat> Ooh, five. I like the look of that. This one's really nice. This one's not like the other one I played. The one starting with a... Oh, man, I think. No, I can't remember. I never remember that one's name. <laughs> like, I could have told like 50 times and it's just like... Nah, it's like one of those words that I'm not confident in saying as well. So I don't say it. I try to avoid saying it. <laughs> That's great, isn't it? Oh, that's another five down there. So th this one doesn't go for a long period of time. The only thing that kind of annoys me is that sometimes these ones don't like line up properly. I guess that's a me problem more than anything. Let's go with that. Let's go with six. Look how big that house is. This is a bit in that big house. It's a bit of like multiple people. You know, it's very uneconomical if there is. I mean, like, one person living in that, one family living in that. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to find, um, let's go with this. I think I'm gonna get 80 tiles as well, so we don't get too much. Or whatever the amount was. Oh, now quest tile. I get better points. Hmm. Probably better off doing that. Ooh, is that a different type of game? Because you get like different ways, different colorations. That's such a pretty interesting thing to think about when you play these games. I've got a really cool image lying around that's for like a screenshot background of really cool looking wheat fields. So it's meant, I think it's meant to be based on Europe. Somewhere around there. But goddamn, those wheat fields look so cool. Yeah, even these look really cool. I really like that subtlety with the wheat and as well. I actually started off making a lot of mine like that. Well, I know Dragon. <clears throat> but then I um, went off to something a bit more realistic because as I got more confident with the style of Pizzolat, it became easy to do that. Oh, more houses? God, it wants me to build a, a nation. A world? Let's build my army. There's a house for you all in there. You probably actually, there's not very many people of it, is there? <laughs> uh. Oh, I will still get the points for that. I wonder if I get more at the same time. I don't know. Six. Uh, 19, 19, 19. Probably do start off in the forest land down there, maybe. I don't know. Ooh, that's a lot. Probably better off doing that because then that's a bit of weight fields on there. So yeah, see how that could be more likely to be weird and this look why it wanted to be a different type of game. You know what I mean? Or not. I don't know if they ever thought that far into it or not. It was like, you know, there's a pretty cool stage of different of the different models. Let's put them in. It may have been just been like that, which is fair enough. I've never like learned so much about grains <laughs> until you literally look and see um, what you need, how to draw them, and whether they live in the way of climates. So I have to like get my hands on some of the native vanilla because I would like to see how that actually, you know, looks when you go from the ground. What I mean by that is the native Australian vanilla. 
I thought they had to be like a, a native bane at one point. I think there's even more as well. But that one I think is just specifically in Australia itself. Might be wrong. Might not be, I don't know. Or sail with New Zealand. New Zealand's one of the other. Sometimes you do sail a lot of stuff with New Zealand, oddly enough. But then we get some birds that are very similar. <clears throat> oh, there's also actually one plant. There's a type of spinach, spinach that's sometimes referred as New Zealand spinach, and then there's got a um, more original name and a white, probably a white name, white man name to it as well, or white English name to it as well. I can't remember exactly what it is. The other name, but there is a type of spinach that both goes wild in. Oh yeah, <laughs> I've been thinking this, haven't I? And whoops. Yeah, there was a type of spinach that both goes wild in New Zealand and Australia that's actually the same. I didn't read what this deer, deer does. Whoops. Okay, so when the place is mountains, let's go expand our mountain land. Go here, actually. All the bells going down. Get a pass of the other. Oh, it is connected. That doesn't really happen, I think, at a small amount. I looked at a Wendley place. We're better off adding Wendley place at the moment. I think. Let's go and build these places now. <laughs> so, part of this is that you meant to build places. Too busy talking about everything. About the cool looking art. Like, the art's cool when I'm busy talking about it. Ugh. I'm gonna have to go get this one. It's kind of temptation. I'll get this. I will call it again if I get this in full version. Hmm. Do that. Oh, might as well do this actually. <clears throat> it's gonna be a bit of land. Oh, mountain way. There we go. Oh. Oh, that's a bit problematic. Mm, very problematic actually. I'm sure that we're facing the class I know. <laughs> These people must work down there. That's the best position they can be in, although it's not the healthiest position they can be in. I have place to put points. Mountainsides! Ooh, we can go like this. Look at that. Smooth. Look at our mountain range. Ah, gonna be like the Great Dividing Range! You know, one side's cold and one side's really hot, not the same. <laughs> or has a reasonable temperature balance. Actually, that's usually like what the Great Dividing Range in Australia is. At least we're on my end of it. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's like universal as well. To be like that. Oh, yeah, we got one of these card things, you know. I'm really sieving these card things. You know, I'm feeling like silo time, you know? Silo. Got a silo. Got a silo in the corner there. Silo time. Let me sound playing like the recording the demo. Oh, this one. Dan. I want to go food down as I can still play hang around. Hey man, oh yeah, I can do this. Hmm. Let's really start getting our pulse there maybe in here, I don't know. I still haven't put down a noble tile to reach out to there. Hmm. 
There's a four there. We need some wheat. Put some wheat around the world. We got some wheat. 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 We got some wheat. 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 I'm not really getting those points, am I, at the moment? Four. Yeah, that's pretty good. Here we go. What's this one? Or all rounder? I guess we could do it like that. Well, that's a lot of pointos. It is a bit annoying, it's not like in that white spot, like if it was like in the perfect, like, if it was fifth around, it would be like, boom, this is the size of hell. I might do it like that, but... And that tree is a loner. And I guess like me, I guess that's how it is, isn't it? Okay, I mean... Let's go for the four pointos. Oh yeah, we do this. Eh. So they're just standing around and not doing anything. Seven. Water signs. i become that one becomes more valuable probably when I get around to it. Um, we have wheat fields. I've noticed in the full game they've also like added like symbols onto those multi ones so you don't have to be like oh what's the color as well oh yeah this <clears throat> um let's put a rise in here let's go have a look at this what does he even do i can't remember oh Bloody. Okay. This one tells are a bit annoying, but hey. How it is sometimes. I say in there. I guess we can make a box around it. We can get this. I feel like there's like an all round one that can get all of these done and dusted, you know? Or not, whatever way works. But yeah, I could put a flowers worky one in there. Oh, we got a tractor! You guys like my new tractor? I'm expanding my empire. I know why. I'm not just taking- I'm just gonna let people die and take- I take everything they own. I'm not that evil. They can have things. Oh, I can shove this in here. Shove you in there. Huh, I'm surprised I can't just shove you in there, okay. I have to do it the other way around. Yay! More houses! Look at all my beautiful houses! See, we just constructed... We had a building... Wave. Which means everybody can get a house. And not worry about where they live. Where they're living. Hmm, what a great way to fix a house in crisis. <laughs> Build houses. Okay, we don't need to go that for wheel. Windmill! Yeah, look at that. That's cool. 
I wish they can in the spells tiles, you know? They would have been quite nice. I don't know if they do in the full one or not. But even just for here, they'd be like really nice if they did count it as full tiles. Oh, look at that lonely mountain boy. This looks really cool. I'm just gonna take a screenshot. I might take one at the end. I might, hang on. No, that'd be spoilers. I'll just leave it like that, halfway through. I might as well hmm, do that. No, 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 I'm getting one pointers. <laughs> Oh, that. I got more chapters! And now we're industrializing. That's important. We got our outskirts, miners. There we go. Oh, is that we upgrades? Mm. <laughs> I'm actually hungry at the moment, that's nice, isn't it? There we go, I just wanted to build a silo. Nothing interesting that happens. Then we go to here. Oh, and Tenny Pong himself getting the next thing. Uh, I guess we could do that, or we can do a fifteen. Go. Oh. What do you want to do? Upgrade hillside. Hmm, that's a hillside college. Well, we get someone to live down there. We can go for. All these look really cool. The fountain. We can do that. Yeah, you know, I might as well build the fountain first before I put any before I finish that little quest down there. Let's go thinking ahead. He's living on top of the walk. Living on top of the walk. The walk walk. There we go. Look at all the goodness. Oh, I can't even see the window. There we go. Oh my god, this is epic. I'm, I'm gonna take a screenshot out. That actually looks really cool. Cam angles. That might be our main screenshot. Look at this. Am I ingenious or not? I feel ingenious. <laughs> Did not work out the way I meant today. Whoops, I was not meant to do that one. That didn't work out as planned, didn't it? Mm. I said it probably devastated me more, Matilda being honest. I don't even know how I'm going to finish that now. Hmm. That probably just devastated me more. <laughs> right. Alright. Oh, look at that card thing. Hmm. What do we want? 
I'll do big G for you guys. Big G, we got a big G, big G, we got a big G. Ah, oh, I just really got dust up my nose, you yeah. know. I've cleaned out my sister's computer, and that's how that happened. <laughs> Holy strange. You know, yeah, yeah, man. I thought for a moment I was like, what? You know? like, I was like, what? And my nose, when did my nose bleed? But then I'm like, oh yeah, it's dust. I can't even remember what this one did. I literally sieved this away. I think it's upgrading Forest Land, so I guess I might as well keep it for that Forest Land, since this Forest Land is pretty, you know, well long, as they say. I I say, I guess. Look at this. Diversity in farming. That's good farming practice. We're gonna have a pay join on there, won't we? Industrial farmlands. Actually, non industrial. It is small farmland. It is small. It is actually a community owned farmland. The community pitches in and look after the farmland. That is our, what our farmlands are. You don't need to tell me if it's gonna go away, disappear up to the skylands. Houses, gotta put some houses down. Houses. Oh, I need a multi a Phoenix. Oh. Look at that. Upgrades. For that, so we know better, yeah. And we got a bit of like in the forest land. This was a lot behind the scenes that we're going to do. Okay, this couple things still annoy me. It's like the weapon to my chocolate that I had, like, I just threw it down there and I couldn't be bothered to pick it back up, which is annoying. Hmm. It's starting to get really big now. Actually, my fault and my mountainside's ended now, huh? I thought I locked it in. Looks like it's not going to be a great dividing range. Hmm. And let's go with that. Four. Oh, the camera you have? I can't see the number over there. <laughs> down the place it down. Place down. Oh yes, we got the perfect tile. Oh, more farmhouses. Oh, I put my farmhouse down there. Look at that. That's how you know we're a farming community here. One that we all chipped in and help out farming. Oh, 
Yeah, Mountain Side still continues. But that's a pretty that's pretty cool when you think about it. Is that they kind of their houses live through the mountain the edge of the mountainside? A lot, of these, a lot of these ones, especially the other one I played, I feel like we need to more a, you know, I, I like the idea of how this game naturally progresses over time, period, with its buildings and everything like that, but you know, I feel like there needs to be an easier game mode, especially for the other one I played, it's sort of like this, I feel like there's, I want an easier mode to where I don't have to try that hard, but I still get that natural progression of buildings without having to worry about the score because sometimes you just want to play for a long period of time is the thing that I like playing in is a long period of time see where the points and all that lead me into a larger world you know you know what I mean or not we can go fishing or oh, not actually might, uh, might as well go for this one there we go I might as well do that before we went out. I guess we've still got a long way from there. But you, you guys know what I mean. Something like a game like the other one I played would drastically benefit from what I just said. A easier mode rather than they have a creative mode they put her in, in if you have not been up to date with them. But not really a easy mode, I would say. Or casual mode. Actually casual mode would probably be better naming for it because it would be more of a casual mode and I guess easy as well but I feel like it I feel like something like that would be more of a casual mode where I don't have to focus on the points of the hand and so I guess you still have a point system it's not like needed when you get the white type of get the or, or get the casual mode in There we go. Look at my air balloon. We have industrial. We have transport to the skies now. We have. We made it to the skies with the people of the air. We now wield the air. I don't know why it's not moving. <laughs> like, nah, I'm good, man. I'm just gonna stand here. Look at it. We have moved to the skies. We have transportation between our, between our lands, over these mountainsides, to the mines, making it far more efficient. Although, let's be honest, this is actually a pretty efficient, um, and like, well, when you think about it. Because the main area and the farm is up here. Then down here we just have the forest and the walks, so it's a pretty efficient, um, well, when you really think about it. So we don't have to worry about it being too inefficient, you know? Hmm, that one's a six, this one's a five. No, oh, it doesn't count, my poor boy. That's probably manic. I kind of like the six more, you know, that six is shining its ass off at me more. I should probably finish these off. Boom. Well, that must be what it means is that the more upgraded it is, the more your points you're going to get for it when you place something down next to it, I think. Oh, I don't know actually, maybe it was distract B ones, be the tie-up ones down there.
I had him. I swear I had him moving before, but anyway. Look at our industrial era. I mean, our flying era. I'm a great town. Self driving tractors. We're ahead of the game, guys. What you would need to do is build a train, like going through here, over across the water, and you literally connect everything to each other. <laughs> like, wow, we built a pretty efficient town. And we weren't even realizing it that we did it pretty efficiently either. There we go. They're like, I'm excited to go bush housing. Oh, there's eight again. There we go. Three ones must be pretty valuable. Maybe that's what it is. I don't know. We zoom in because I'm mainly using the mouse wheel, so we zoom in like wow with that. Like that sometimes it's the mouse wheel's problem. I want to get these people near each other, you know? Must be starting to get, yeah, 11 something. Still do a bit of play up later on. We might as well end it. Probably should burn my eyes before I forget to do it. <laughs> hmm. Well, it's probably a reasonable idea. There we go. Where do we want to put our folks land? I guess we can put it down nearby the houses. Oh, we're gonna low. Um, do we have anything to fall in this gap? No, we do not. Let's pull in this gap or something. Oh. <laughs> we can't feel it, but sadly. Pick one later because we can't feel it in here. Let's go with our. Um, mountains down there. With that, there we go. Where's that like thing go on this bad boy? Hmm. Unless this is the best single. I don't know why it keeps pausing like that. Must be when the pause. Can I get rid of the UI? I guess we have to go reverse. Oh no, we can't do that. Damn. Let's do it out. I wanted to like, you know, get a nice clean shot without the... That there. Mm, even this one would be really nice actually. Yeah, let's go with that. So I hope you enjoyed that one. A little view of this one is... Paylog? I think, yeah, Paylog version of it. I haven't got the full version of it quite yet, but maybe that's a food thing I'll get. I don't know. 
But I thought that would be interesting one to go have a look at. So we did 9 of 16 buildings. There's like um, 52 in the full version of the game. So I hope you enjoy. I'm Local Wolf. Now, thanks for watching. Have a nice day. I'll see you next time.